Welcome to Rick's Pokemon Platinum Walkthrough Part 28. So, we are heading on to our Pastoria City Gym Badge. Dang it. But before we get to Pastoria City, we are heading towards Lake Valor, which is the little area between, um, between uh, Veilstone City and Pastoria City. It's like a town, kind of. And there's a lot of exciting things there and all this. So, yeah. Uh, this could take forever. This trainer that I'm battling switches out his Pokemon a lot. He has a Flareon, Vaporeon, and Jolteon. But since I'm using Sand Tomb, he won't be able to switch out Jolteon until it's dead, so... Oh, that's an annoying noise. Gosh. Ah. Stupid Jilteon. Oh my gosh. Please hit. Okay, seriously? Sand attack is such an annoying move, but... When they use it like this, it gets even worse. Honestly. Okay, Jaws, come on. There we go. Finally. Alright, Jolteon's out of here. Vaporeon. That's an uh oh. Time to use my own EV evolution against this one. time now there we go solar beam looks really awesome in this game I like it hyper beam looks cool too no oh, you've got to be kidding me water gun why are you using water gun I'm gonna use ah oh, dang it I was gonna use bullet seed again but oh well solar beam will have to do There's that. Alright. Yay! Leaf Young Grid level 24. Flareon. I'm gonna send out Jaws anyway, but I'm not gonna battle with him because he's in his reds. I mean, her. She's. Well, it doesn't. Alright. Quack, how about you take care of this one? Ah, oh, sand attack again. So annoying. You're going down, buddy. This trainer is very annoying. Haha, <laughs> Water Pulse does confuse sometimes, and that's what's so awesome about it. See? 
And Jaws grows to level 24. Sweet! Jaws is evolving into a Gabite. Awesome. That really rocks. Even though I won't really need him for my next gym battle, still, it's awesome to have one. Alright, run down here. I do not like this music, it's boring. Hey, can we go in here? Can I? There's a Pokemon in there? Well, thanks for telling me that. I'll be sure to come back there later. Hey, another pathway. Hey, hey, what? Yeah, so that guy blocks your path to Shiny Sunny Shore City, which is the um eighth gym, and he'll no, he won't leave until you've captured the legendary Pokemon. So walk in here and talk to this guy, and he'll heal up your Pokemon for you, which is pretty nice. Let's look at my Pokemon. Ooh. Jaws. I'm gonna give Leafy on the. I'm gonna put Leafy on at the front of my team because I need him to get some leveling up. Because so I'm gonna need him the most in my Pastoria City gym battle. Alright. So, if you walk over here and into this building right here, this is um, called the. I can't remember what it's called. Let me go look. The Seven Stars Restaurant. It's like a fancy restaurant, and every guy in here. Everybody in here are double battles, so if you talk to them, then you can battle them, like so. Eugene. Alright. So, yeah, that's a pretty good way to train up, and we're gonna go through this place. Just for the heck of it. Alright. Alright. We're going to use Bullet Seed on Feebas, that's a new one, and Dragon Rage on Roselia. Dragon Rage is so awesome. Toxic spikes, of course. She's quick attack. And Dragon Rage. There we go. Bye bye, Roselia. So yeah, this place is a great place to train for your next gym badge. I recommend it for sure. It is closed really er It opens from 9 o'clock. It is open from 9 o'clock in the morning to 10 o'clock at night. So if it's like 6 o'clock in the morning, then no trainers will be here and it'll be closed. Sorry about that, just messing with the camera a little. Alright, there we go. We're gonna use Quick Attack on Lickitung and Dragon Rage on Cleffa. C 
sing. Shoot. With all moves that were annoying that she had to use. It just had to be sing. I am going to kill this Cleffa right here and now. So annoying. So yeah, very annoying stuff. So yeah, basically, I'm just gonna be training in here and once I've beaten all the trainers we'll be heading for Pastoria City so I will see you then ah oh, shoot <laughs>